This practice that we're offering is now all focused on releasing the fear of letting go. So we're looking at how we hold that on a somatic, physical level, how we hold it emotionally, psychologically, how we hold it in our thoughts and our belief systems. So this asana practice is a very simple, basic, beginner's practice to be able to support a very like simple way of, on a daily level, releasing that fear of letting go, which of course, the symptoms of not letting go is stress and, and all the maleficent effects that has um, on the physical body. So to begin with, just centering into your belly, breathing into the belly. And we're gonna do it with the mouth open, breathing into the belly, sucking in the breath, emptying out, sighing out, and perhaps intending to lengthen your exhale so that you can have that sense of like teaching the body, reteaching it to facilitate letting go. And the exhale creates that wave. So it's inhale, exhale. Then you want to hear it like a sound of the ocean, like the waves crashing in, the waves rolling out. So it's just And then start to bring a dhyana focus, a concentration. So you're not just doing the breath work, the pranayama, we now bring in the actual meditation, which is bringing the focus into the belly, the abdomen area, breathing in here. And the exhale, emptying out the breath, traveling up the body in three-part awareness. So it's sort of emptying at the belly, emptying at the chest, heart, lungs, and last, head. So the breath is completely out and then travel down, sucking in down to the belly and exhale, emptying out. So it's like this current is rising up, drawing down. You feel this cranial wave, energy of life. Breathing in, filling up, recharging your cells, revitalizing, rejuvenating, exhaling, emptying, releasing, letting go. And if we can, we're going to do this through the asana practice, that sense of being able to really deeply drop into the sort of belly of being, this physical holding center that is the Svadhasana chakra. Breathing with awareness, pass through the solar plexus, opening through the heart, the chest, feeling the bottom back part of the lungs expand. It's more, more like a sort of sense of sideways breathing here, and then all the way last up into the head. So we're traveling up, traveling down until you sort of hypnotize yourself into a trance state and then we carry that into this asana flow. So the first simple mudra that we're going to do is thumbs in the ears. So don't do it until you've actually heard the instructions. So you're breathing in and then humming out like buzzing bees. You should almost feel like a reverberation in your teeth, like a massage for your skull, for your jaw, as you feel the OM vibration, just loosening up tension in the jaw, these senses of survival stress. So you're gonna do this five times to five counts. Inhale, breathing golden light into the heart with 360 degrees awareness, sucking all that breath in, then OMing out. The mouth closed. Mm. Mm. So you'll do that five times. And it's very powerful if you've got any sort of stress tension in the jaw or headaches or migraines. It loosens, returns everything to spaciousness. So you're looking in yoga to really come to that place of transparency where you become so completely aware of consciousness in the form that the form starts to dissipate and dissolve or sort of pixelate into vibrational awareness. So you're de-densifying places of holding and constriction, congestion, where there's sort of stuck emotional charge as well. So you can go for more than five times, but a minimum of that with that one. And then you're just gonna take your hands together, rub them together, and feel like the flow of your heart this meta loving intention for well-being, for this loving self-kindness practice, 
is generated flowing from your heart, heating up your hands, flowing through your hands, and you feel this golden flow coming out, emanating this radiant light, and then just sealing them into the eyes. Sinking in there like a massage for your eyes, which is almost like a massage for your brain as well, it's like a cushion for the head. And then just slowly soothing the parasympathetic, just stroking out through the body. And we can do that out through the arms, through the hands, all down the legs, just soothing. And you feel that tingling sensation of this like loving self-practice where you feel sort of subtler vibrational awareness of your energy system. So we're really allowing the energy bodies to move. And the physical is, is the last level. So let the breath be the guiding factor through this practice. And we're going to do it in a very flowing way. So I'm going to do it in silence. So you can see it first of all, and then we can break it down if you need more um, <clears throat> guidance. Start with your prayer, your intention for what it is you want to let go of, what you're truly ready to relinquish, to create space to receive and to bring in the new. But at first, let's fully become focused in all the nitty gritty details of where we're holding on, where we wish to let go. And we'll do three ohms, more like a sort of internal self-healing massage, rather than trying to make some pretty sound. Oh. from here just a slight sense of letting your heart flower through the open lotus to receive yielding letting your system become open and porous a sense of open heartedness open presence and then just wind out the wrists and we begin a silent flow together
So just closing that flow with a balasana, a child's pose to seal the practice, to enter pratyahara, to really turn within from those flowing dynamic movements, just approaching it like a dance. So the breath leads the movement, sucking in through the mouth and out through the mouth, letting go. And each time you're breathing in, you're breathing into where perhaps the contraction, the sense of eye separation consciousness is sitting, where the main pain or discomfort is. And each time you're breathing out, you're relinquishing it, giving it away, allowing it to move out through the pathways of the body. So this simple slow is also supporting the meridian lines of the gallbladder, that relinquishing, letting go factor, so that the system can learn how to soften and find activation and then allow the deep relaxation to happen in the midst of that. So that's the ultimate yoga practice, is really all leading towards the savasana, the surrender. Thank you for listening. Om Nasatoma Satkamaya Tamasoma Jyotye Gamaya Vityoma Mrutam Gamaya Om Shanti 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 Om Shri Gripya Namaha Hari Om